In most states where the youths are clamoring for better opportunities and a more inclusive government. According to many of the youths who spoke to our correspondents, the current condition of youths in the state is not conducive, adding that there is urgent need to salvage the situation. I don't think uh, the youth uh, uh, have been given the necessary support, especially from the government, because uh, from the look of things, uh, you do not need to be told if you're from Imo or you're schooling here in Imo State, the way things are. I'm actually not happy with the situation of our country. There's a lot of unemployment. Youths are graduating from school. Help them to actually have employment. They're not actually being employed. The government should provide more employment opportunities, create more jobs. And also, they can also offer loan to youths who actually want to use the money, create jobs. In a move aimed at empowering the youth and addressing their developmental needs, Governor Hopu Zodima of Imo State has created a new Ministry of Youth Development. The commissioner in charge, Dr. Mandela Ukeagu, said the new ministry is expected to oversee initiatives and programs aimed at enhancing youth empowerment. The youths are hopeful that the ministry will live up to expectation in alleviating most of their suffering. We have a whole lot of companies in Nigeria and outside Nigeria that are just looking for people who know how to do some practical things. Practical, not theoretical. Now, those of our youths who are not into the university setting or the lecturing setting, we are going to use these technical schools, these technical halls to teach them these practical handbooks that we are sure that will make them earn a living. 